Good morning, everybody. I hope you're okay on this rainy Monday. I've got our story for the week here, and it's called The Three Billy Goats Gruff. And this is a traditional tale. Now, this year we've looked at some other traditional tales, haven't we? I wonder if you can remember any. I can remember The Three Little Pigs and Little Red Riding Hood. Can you remember any more? So, here's another traditional tra tale. The Three Billy Goats Gruff. Once upon a time, there were three Billy Goats Gruff. There was a little Billy Goat Gruff, a middle-sized Billy Goat Gruff, and a big Billy Goat Gruff. There they are. We've got little, medium, and big. They're in size order, aren't they? The three Billy Goats Gruff lived in a field, and they spent their days munching the green grass. On one side of the field, there was a stream, and over the stream, there was a rickety bridge. Here's the rickety bridge, look. We made some bridges in class, didn't we? On the other side of the rickety bridge, there was a hill, and there, and there the grass grew greener and sweeter than it did in the field of the billy goat's gruff. Hmm, I wonder what they might want to do. Do you think they might want to go over the bridge to find the sweet green grass? Under the rickety bridge lived a big, hairy troll in a deep, dark hole. It was, a damp and cold, it was damp and cold under the bridge and that made the troll furious. He was also hungry. I love that word, furious. That's a good word for angry, isn't it? One day the little billy goat gruff looked up and saw that the grass up the hill on the other side of the stream looked very green and sweet. I think I'll move over there for my next course, he said. Then I'll grow big and fat. So trip, trap, trip, trap went the hooves of the little billy goat gruff as he started to cross the rickety bridge. <gasps> there he goes. I wonder what will happen next. Can you make a prediction? The big hairy troll woke up with a start. Who's that crossing my bridge? He roared. I am, said the little billy goat gruff. I'm crossing the bridge to eat the grass on the other side of the stream. Oh, no, you're not, said the big hairy troll. And he sang, I'm a troll from the deep dark hole. My belly's getting thinner. I need to eat and goats a treat. So I'll have you for my dinner. <gasps> oh no. Oh, don't do that, said the little billy goat gruff. I'm only small. I wouldn't make much of a mouthful. Wait for my brother. He's much bigger. And he skipped over the rickety bridge to the other side. <gasps> that was clever thinking, wasn't it, of the little goat? Just then, the middle-sized billy goat gruff looked up and he too saw that the grass on the other side looked very green and sweet. I think I'll move over there for my next course, he said. Then I'll grow bigger and fatter. So trip, trap, trip, trap went the hooves of the middle-sized billy goat gruff as he started to cross the rickety bridge. The troll spotted him like, I wonder what he'll say. Who's that crossing my bridge? roared the big hairy troll. I am, said the middle-sized billy goat gruff. I'm crossing the bridge to eat the grass on the other side of the stream. Oh no, you're not, said the big hairy troll. And he sang, I'm a troll from the deep dark hole. My belly's getting thinner. I need to eat and goats a treat. So I'll have you for my dinner. Oh, don't do that, said the middle-sized billy goat gruff. I'm not very big. I wouldn't make much of a mouthful. Wait for my brother. He is much, much bigger. And he skipped over the trickety bridge to the other side. Another lucky escape from the troll. Just then the big billy goat gruff looked up and he too saw that the grass on the other side of the stream looked very green and sweet. I think I'll move over there for my next course, he said. Then I'll grow even bigger and fatter. So trip, trap, trip, trap went the hooves of the big billy goat gruff as he started to cross the rickety bridge. Who's that crossing my bridge, roared the big hairy troll. 
I am, said the big billy goat gruff. I'm crossing the bridge to eat the grass on the other side of the stream. Oh, no, you're not, said the troll. And he sang. I'm a troll from the deep dark hole. My belly's getting thinner. I need to eat and go to treat. So I'll have you for my dinner. The big billy goat gruff stopped. His knees shook. His hooves trembled, clickety-clack, clickety-clack on the rickety bridge. Then he pulled himself together. I don't think you will, he said. And he picked up his hooves and he kicked the troll into the middle of next week. <gasps> that means he kicked him really, really hard. And off he goes, look. He's even found a flower. Then... The big billy goat gruff skipped over the rickety bridge to join his brothers on the other side of the hill. There they all are, look. As for the big hairy troll, I am happy to say that he was never seen again. <gasps> Just like the other traditional tales that we've read, it's got a happy ending, hasn't it? They managed to get rid of that naughty troll. I hope they enjoyed the grass on the other side. Now, if you've picked up a learning pack from home, or if you're going to pick one up later today, you'll find some activities to do about, all about this story. So you can have a go at some writing or some sequencing of the pictures, okay? See you soon. <laughs>